How many calories you should eat lose weight varies for different individual. The calorie needs are different for different individual. So, you need to first understand how many calories you need daily to perform the activities in your day. Once you are able to calculate your daily requirements, you can simply get under a calorie deficit mode to lose weight. However it is not as simple as it appears to you. It involves you to understand following terminologies. You need a step-by-step -step approach to understand how to lose weight. How to calculate daily calories. You need energy to perform your day-to-day -day activities. The functions like breathing, pumping blood and your other bodily activities also burn calories. So the amount of calories you burn in your day is combination of two activities. One is going in your body which is referred as BMR, basal metabolic rate. The other activity is what you perform outside your body. Everything requires energy and you create energy by burning calories. How many calories you spend in your day depends upon your BMR and your activity factor. So how can you calculate the BMR and your activity factor? BMR, men, equals 66 plus, 13.7 x weight in kilogram, plus, 5 x height in cm, 6.8 x age in years, BMR, woman, equals 655 plus, 9.6 x weight in kilogram, plus, 1.8 x height in cm, 4.7 x age in years, activity factor, sedentary, little to no activity, 1.2. Little active strength training for 2 to 3 days a week or similar 1.375 Moderate activity strength training for 3 to 5 days a week or similar 1.55 Highly active strength training for 3 to 5 days and 1 to 2 days of cardio in a week 1.725 Extreme activity training for 2 times a day with heavy weight training and cardio in a week 1.9 after calculating both the BMR and the activity factor, you can simply calculate your daily calorie expenditure by this equation. TDEE, total daily energy expenditure, equals BMR x activity factor. The TDEE will give you the glimpse of how many calories your body needs daily to maintain its current weight. This is a borderline calorie mar for you. If you wish to lose weight you should eat fewer calories below this mark. And if you wish to gain weight, you will be eating more than this mark. In order to lose 1 pound of body weight, you need a calorie restriction of 3,500 calories. This means you need to burn 3,500 calories to lose 1 pound of body weight. Imagine you are eating 500 calories less daily than what your body needs. Then, you can lose 1 pound of weight in a week. You need to shed calories from your diet gradually and should not go on a strict calorie deficit diet. Aim to shed 300 calories daily from your diet and do not go below your BMR mark. How to cut calories to lose weight. Follow these quick tips to cut calories from your diet. These quick tips will allow you to cut calories without making any major changes into your current eating style. Staying away from emotional hunger using small portions food swaps protein-rich vegetables in every meal 5. Doing exercise. 6. Read your product labels. Macronutrient planning. An important tip for you to lose weight is to indulge in healthy eating. Take proper nutrition and follow a healthy lifestyle. All calories are not created equal and only nutritional eating is your way to go for weight loss. A 100 calorie McFries is not same as 100 calories from green vegetables. You should plan your macronutrients accordingly. Consume your daily calories in ratio of 30% carbohydrates, 45% protein and 25% fat to lose weight in a good way.